in a world, in a world, where in one, a world, man, one man, where one man defeats all, defeats expectations. all expectations. Defeats all expectations. Walters Express. Experience the experience. What's up? It's me, the guy on the channel. You know, the one you're watching? Yeah, you do. Yeah, you do. To my channel, the best place in the world, <laughs> clearly. <laughs> Am I right? Um, yeah, man, tell your friends and shit. Uh, don't tell my friends. They're a bunch of bricks, kidding. They're watching this. At least I know one of them will be, maybe. I don't know. Um, yeah, I want to try and get back into this, uh, YouTube thing a whole lot more, um, take my time this time, each video, uh, this channel's definitely not going to be safe for work, or your children, so they can fuck off, but, uh, if they are watching it, just go a little down there and tell them to click that big red button, or if I learn how to do fucking annotations, like, I'll put it somewhere around here, there, uh -huh. Um, but, yeah, like, I just want to do stuff I enjoy, not so much do stuff that, uh, other people want me to do, I guess. Um, it is a bit hard for me, because I, uh, have work and everything else like that, but, you know, I'm going to try to, you know, keep coming back with new things. Um, last time I was doing YouTubing, uh, some of my videos are still on my channel currently, Others are either private or unlisted, things like that. Um, I had a really shitty PC, and that noise in the background, unfortunately, currently is my current PC. Uh, it's like the fans and shit working. Um, I might maybe put a like a specs list underneath um, if I get time uh, after editing this video and posting it. But right now. Um, pretty solid. I want to try and do a bit more like, uh, uh, how do I put it, like, I want to try to do like a lot more, whoa, chair. um, work with, uh, non-copyrighted content. Um, 80% of my YouTube videos before were copyrighted content because, like, I put songs in there and things like that that unfortunately someone else owned and you know <laughs> I'm an idiot um when I did start this though I was well, like I mean I first started YouTube oh, years and years ago maybe 2012 I properly started it um and I wasn't any good at it I'm probably still not good at it but hey I'm gonna do it because I like it so fuck you no, um but yeah <laughs> I don't know. I want to enjoy it. A little heads up. I'm back. I want to work on like a like a really really short like maybe five second intro. Um, so if anyone's really good at intro work or just wants to get experience because I ain't paying no one, fuck y'all. Hit me up. Uh, I got like some ideas, but I'm sure other people have better. <laughs> um, yeah, some sort of intro, uh, I want to work on like maybe uh, an intro, um, not an intro song, like maybe a background track or something like that. Um, I'm not very savvy with any of that stuff. Uh, but we'll work on it. We'll, we'll work on it. Cool. Um, stuff you see on my channel, mainly game videos, maybe some Dungeons and Dragons work, because I do enjoy that. A lot of people give it like a lot of stereotypical like, oh... Look at that nerd over there. That's a nerd voice. Look at that nerd over there, man. He's fucking Dungeons and Dragons and shit. But it's not like a bunch of people sit on the table like, I want to kill you, my plus four sword. No, it's not like that. It's, it brings a lot of people together. She's looking at me again. Yeah, Dalmatian. Um, it brings a lot of people together. And it definitely, like, it definitely helps friendships as well. And you know, you get to learn what people are like as well. I'm not saying like, you know, oh, he's a weirdo, don't hang out with him or anything like that. No, it honestly does help quite a lot to know what your friends are like or make new friends, things like that. Um, I currently DM one. I was DMing two uh, games or campaigns, so to say. Um, but one of them went all over the place and me and my characters agreed that 
that was my idea, but we'd just scrap it and start again, like a new Dungeon Dragon fantasy thing. The other one I DMing at currently is a Fifth Age campaign, which is a like a futuristic like space type thing, which is cool. I originally wanted to do a Star Wars campaign because um, I absolutely love Star Wars, and I was even writing my own rule books only to find out that there are <laughs> things like Edge of the Empire and all that. Um, but then it clicked to me that you know, as much as I'd love to play mainly, I'd love to play any Dungeons and Dragons game, but unfortunately no one else DMs on me and the DM that I know currently. Because um, everyone wants to play. But, um, yeah, Star Wars, and I was like, yeah, it'll be really cool until I found out that, um, you know what? Uh, no one else but me uh, in my D&D group uh, likes Star Wars. Well, not so much likes it, but, you know, follows it or, you know, actually enjoys playing games to do with Star Wars. Maybe one other person does. Um, yeah, I don't, I don't know, man. I just, I just don't know. Um, but yeah, I'm back. What up? Uh, and I'll see y'all on the flip side. Peace. I'll be back. Yotch.